To be honest with you, I've felt better in my life. <laughs> Okay, so we just got here, we had lunch, we got our room, and of course, since we're staying at the Aria, I have to get Grant to come see the Jenny Pulser because I love it. And I've only gone to see it, I think maybe twice. I went by myself the last time, and it's a highlight of my life. Goodbye. Goodbye. Have fun at school. I love, you. I love you bye okay hello it's thursday we're in vegas i'm in the room grant just left he went to a little conference meeting opener i don't know what it is to be honest with you it's in this hotel we're staying in the aria and right now i just published my new video Woo! vegas baby living it up publishing a youtube video honestly i was kind of trying not to vlog today because i felt like it was going to be a boring day but what if it's not and i don't vlog uh, i think youtube has ruined my brain <laughs> i need to go do comments and then get ready mm, all that are you ready i'm ready grant learned so much so much i think i'm gonna change it what since he got back he was like all right get ready get ready we gotta go eat da, da, da. and then i'm all ready i do my little shot saying we're leaving and he says i gotta change oh you can change i don't care i don't want to look like a lump next to you dressed up in your fancy shorts <laughs> my fancy shorts oh my gosh i gotta show you my fancy shorts so i just got these and uh it was a mistake. Ooh, this lighting. These shorts are, you know, kind of fancy. I just got them last weekend, but they kind of don't fit right here. I guess I was just having like a little bit of a bloated weekend. And then here, they just make me look like I have absolutely no booty. And like, okay, yes, I pretty much have no booty, but like I got a little bit of one and you know, it needs all the emphasizing it can get. And these shorts, they just not doing it. And yeah. They might be a little bit fancy, but they're not very flattering and I'm not very happy about it. <laughs> I look like, blah. why would they put a full length mirror and like the scariest light right here? Did I even show you guys this purse that Grant got me? I don't think I did. It is so cute and I love it. Bam, say my name. Forever yawning. <laughs> I'm shaking. Oh, we're cold. morning and to be honest with you i felt better in my life last night we went out we had fun we really didn't even stay out that long but i just slept in really late and it's already 
11 o'clock and I just ordered a little breakfast and I'm about to chow down because I'm so hungry and look at my hair I promise it looked so much better last night and I didn't really vlog yesterday because I shot a video for my main channel so if you're interested in knowing the story behind this hair and generally what we did on Friday you'll have to look out for that video on my main channel it's coming out later this week don't really know how that's gonna turn out because it's kind of crazy but back to this hair uh, I thought I could sleep in it and it would still survive today and I could kind of like ride it on through for the rest of the weekend But now I'm not really sure. I don't know. Let's see like I haven't really taken like a good hard look at it yet It's kind of okay. It's still definitely very much there <laughs> I could probably make this work like, I have to make up my mind because I gotta get the show on the road. Grant's gonna be done with his conference at about three or four, and I have a few things that I wanna do, but I'm definitely trying to have a much more relaxing day today than I did yesterday. I was running around everywhere yesterday, and it was really fun, but it was kind of a little bit stressful. So I'm trying to chill out and take care of myself today because we definitely had some fun last night and we're supposed to have a little more fun tonight. Oh, I'm so excited about tonight. Okay, okay, more about that later. I'm gonna eat. about to head out and get a pedicure you don't even know the situation down there is really bad and I've needed a pedicure for so long I just haven't found the time to do it after checking out the prices for getting a manicure and pedicure here in this hotel the cheapest like most express manicure pedicure you can get is $85 and I'm not really here to do that so I'm going to a place that I hope is not too far away and hopefully it works out but yeah, this pedicure is just very, very needed. And like I said, I'm trying to relax. Okay, obviously I decided to keep the hairdo intact. Um, it's definitely very deflated compared to what it was yesterday, but I think it still looks all right, right? Uh, I just decided I didn't want to mess with it. All of this is just like extremely teased. I knew it would take me forever to brush it out and I just didn't have the patience not today not tomorrow probably the next day so until then i'm just gonna be living my best amy winehouse life and you know what it's not it's not an everyday look but i do think it's cute uh for my outfit i'm actually wearing two new things or three new things i don't really stand behind these boots with this outfit but it's just what i've got this like neon fluorescent pink top is from zara it's slightly cropped but it's just like this really really comfy stretch almost like a sweater material oh, and I love the color and then these jeans are also new I ordered them from Madewell and I've never ordered the taller size I usually just get tall but maybe the taller version are working for me I don't know lately I've just been feeling so sick of just having my ankles exposed in cold weather I was just like okay I've had enough I know this is a trend but like I'm drawing a line my ankles will be covered at least part of the time. You know I love the ones that like button up the front here. I wear those constantly, but I just, I needed some ankle covering jeans. And even though you can't see it because of my boots, these cover my ankles and it's very nice. Okay, I'm stalling. Oh, my mouth is dry. I need help today. So I just got all ready. It was a really quick turnaround. My nails are good. 
I hope my toes are not getting screwed up in these shoes, but I had to move fast because we're just about to head out to dinner and I actually don't know where we're gonna go. And then we're going to see a show. It's called The Rat Pack Is Back. And so it's, what do you call it when I, it, I was about to say it's like an impression. Impersonator? An impersonator, but it's, it's The Rat Pack it's and they're doing tribute. a show uh, and it's at the Tuscany. Oh, I've never been there, um, but I'm excited to see this show. I feel like this is just a continuation of our like old Vegas yeah. fascination. We are always like trying to figure out why there isn't more old Vegas. Why do they just tear it all down? And why are they not capitalizing on the interest? I mean, maybe the interest isn't there. Maybe it's just us. It can't just be us if this show is happening. So, so I think the show will be fun. Uh, I love my dress. I pretty much take every single excuse I possibly can to wear this dress. I've had it for a few years, but it's just like, oof, it's like the most flattering dress in the world. I didn't show you the back though. And on top of that, it's actually really, really comfortable. So I'm excited I'm wearing it. I'm not wearing one of the new dresses that I got to wear because I just want to wear this one. Sometimes you just want to wear your old thing. I'm also wearing a gold bag with silver shoes. I feel like it's a questionable decision, but Grant said that it was the Vegas choice. So I'm making it. Are we rolling? Are you excited? Yeah. Vegas. Right back. Doing it. Awesome. Awesome. I do have to say the carpeting in this hallway is like the best worst Las Vegas carpet because it's all bad, but this is kind of the best of the worst. So it's about two o'clock in the morning. We're back in the room, obviously. I'm all snuggled up in bed, even though I definitely should not be. I need to wash my face. I need to take off my dress. And I probably should take my hair down. I really don't know what's gonna be happening with this hair. We had a really, really fun night. The show was amazing. It was so much more fun than I even expected. We got to sit like front row right by the stage. There was a lot of like crowd involvement. I absolutely recommend that show. It, it was like a lot of like older people. I definitely expected that, but it was so much fun. And their voices were amazing. After the show, we grabbed dinner and then we went to Frankie's Tiki Room and it was packed. It was so much more full than the last time we were there. But oddly enough, I actually ran into two different people that watched my channel and that like just made my whole day slash life. Like, what are the odds? Like I, that was the last place in the world that I would expect to actually like, run into people that watch my channel and it made me so happy and they were both so sweet. And then after that, we just came back to the hotel and we played some slot machines and we played craps. Really, generally, we pretty much came out even. I think we're both lucky. We're so scared of losing too much money. <laughs> actually, you know what? We did lose like $60. Yeah. Which probably isn't much from gambling terms, but I, it was hurting me, it was hurting my soul. But then I was switching around from slot machine to slot machine because I don't really know what I'm doing when it comes to gambling. And I just kept switching and I went to this one, it was called uh, Kitty Glitter. <laughs> And we actually won like 60 bucks right away. And it was a good night. And now I'm really tired. But look what we have. 
a giant bag of Cool Ranch. <laughs> and all night I kind of felt like people were looking at me crazy for like my big Amy Winehouse hair. But I'm still living for it. Are you living for it? Oh, I'm living for it. Loving every minute of it. Bleh. Goodbye world. Oh my gosh, look at my hair. I look like a troll if they wanted to have a bun. Do you love it? Oh, I love it. I'm leaving it. I gotta bring this back to Texas. Try to get it going. Goodbye, Vegas. All right, just before we leave, one more thing. Hold on, look at his face. <laughs> This is a look, boy. Oh, I cannot stop. All right, we're back to Dallas and it's freezing outside and we could not think of anywhere to eat and we are getting chilies to go. We're getting salads. I know, but there's still chili salads. We're Americans. <laughs> we're getting some very American salads. Am I, oh, am I getting left behind? Do you want me to come with you? Grant, he just doesn't even turn around. Grant. Bye.